stencils contain groups of similar shapes. For example, if I'm doing a network diagram, I'm going to go ahead, if I choose a network template, it'll have stencils that'll contain shapes for that type of networking drawing. And shapes are drawing objects that I can drag and drop onto my Visio drawings. Later on, a few lessons down the road, we're going to show you how to create your own shapes. Shapes can be formatted. They can have properties assigned to them. We're going to do a lot of things with shapes. Shapes are sort of the basic building block, no pun intended, of Visio. Thanks for watching. For more information regarding our training videos, please visit www.trainsignal.com.